Hey guys, welcome back. So we are going to a show this weekend. I am taking Callie and Troy. We also have Deli, Checkers, and Olive joining us. So yeah, let's go see how we did in Santa Barbara. Within the allowable time, four jumping faults, first round. So this weekend I planned on doing the meter and the meter 10 with Troy on the first day and then I was going to see kind of which one felt better for the second day. Um, his meter round went pretty good. I mean, I could tell that he hadn't shown a whole lot this last year. Um, I think it's actually been a full year since he has shown almost. Um, his meter, he got a little bit flat coming into the two strides, so he had that railed down. And then in his meter 10 round, he actually had the red oxer down 
which was a hind rail. It was kind of a cheap rail, but um, overall he just felt a little bit wobbly, a little bit green um, in both of his rounds, just like he'd been out of showing for a while. But I was pretty pleased with both of his rounds.
30.446 and the win. So on to Callie's rounds. I'd actually planned to do the meter 10 and the meter 15 with her. Um, I know that this show tends to set a little bit soft, so I felt the 15 would be fine coming off her uh, week at nationals doing the 110s. She did phenomenal um, in her classes. I felt like her 110 was maybe a little bit sticky, uh, which was to be expected, which is why I did it first. And then her meter 15 went really well. She stepped up to the plate on the jump off. Unfortunately, in her jump off, I believe at some point, um, it was either the, the first round or the jump off, but I believe it was in her jump off, she lost her French shoe. I got a trophy! Oh. Uh, she didn't catch her heel at all. She stepped on her shoe and pulled it. Um, unfortunately, she was just about ready to be shod, but I didn't want to get her done right before the show on Thursday, just because She's not one to get foot sore, but she can be a little bit kind of guarded in the way she jumps after her angles change. So I was like, oh, I'll just get her done when she comes back. <sighs> after seeing the shoe and how wonky it was, um, I don't think it would have mattered if I would have gotten her shot or not. I think she actually would have taken a lot of hoof wall. But now I'm gonna put her in bell boots. Um, I think it was more of a footing issue than it was a not a common occurrence. This is the first shoe that Callie's ever sh thrown. <laughs> but, you know, it is what it is. I was super happy with her rounds. Unfortunately, I had to scratch the meter 15 speed stake that I had planned to do, um, which was unfortunate, but that's okay. There's always next time. Otherwise, very happy with her rounds. Sixty-five, four, nine, seven, and clean. Sixty-five, four, nine, one, and clean.
53-643, four faults. So unfortunately, Saturday night um, and Sunday morning, we couldn't find a farrier to tack on Callie's shoe. And to be honest, I trust my farrier a lot with my horse's feet. So Callie scratched Sunday. Um, it ended up that no one actually rode the meter 15 on Sunday, which was very funny. There were a lot of people in the meter 10 though. And I decided because Troy was feeling a little bit green on Saturday that I was gonna just do the meter. So Sunday I just had two meter rounds. Uh, Troy was really good in his first one meter round. Um, his second one, rider error. Oh my goodness. I thought I was going to a different fence. I don't know what I was thinking. My track got all messed up. For some reason I was having issues with that last line and it was a wonderful six and I made it into a horrendous seven. But that's okay. Troy did his part. He crushed it. Um, he actually ended up winning both of his classes because the rail he had was in the speed round and he had a pretty crushing four, four, four fault time. Um, so I was super happy with him. He played his part. Uh, I just need to get my head in the game. Um, and I actually found out that Callie, because she won her meter 15 round, came home with the champion of her 115 because no one rode it today. Uh, and Troy, he ended up being the one meter champion uh, after he won both of his classes today and finishing on his placings yesterday. So I'm super happy with both of them. And I actually had a schooling round on Delhi, and she also took home blue as well. So a fairly successful show. The girls did great. And on to our show next weekend. So stay tuned for that. And thank you guys so much for watching. I just want to be your superman. Come fly with me, just take my hand.